Agency of Education recently released its annual snapshot of Vermont schools. Heather Boucher is the Interim Secretary of Education. Thanks for being here. Well, thanks, Kat. It's wonderful to be here. In most areas, the state is meeting its educational goals, but not in academic proficiency. Why? Well, I think we can't discount the impact of the um, pandemic on uh, both students social emotional learning and their um, overall sort of wellness and ability to actually focus and um, really pay attention at school. We're still seeing that that is a bit of a challenge for um, some of our schools. And then also um, the overall, um, some of the overall trends that are occurring within education. Um, so we have a lot of turnover, we have a lot of workforce shortages, and all of that actually still is having an impact on how students are doing. Um, what we're inserting a lot of resources, a lot of technical supports for schools and teachers, both in terms of um, the academic uh, aspect of school and also the mental health and wellness side of school. It really all uh, comes together both are really critical and important for students to actually have. We certainly don't want to ignore what's happening in the academic sphere at all. It's really critical and important. What's really critical, though, is that we have to acknowledge that the pandemic has had an impact on the ability of our students to show up and be able to be uh, good learners. And so we're still working on that. So how long can we continue to put the blame on the pandemic when we know that academic proficiency was an issue prior to the pandemic? Sure, uh, we do know that's a great point. We do know that our scores had um, at the state level kind of flattened out uh, for a while before the pandemic, but we saw a, a much steeper decline um, as a result of the pandemic um, and even more so of a decline for our students who we consider to be historically marginalized. So agree, we uh, had some work to do even before the pandemic and we were starting at the Agency of Education in partnership with our legislature to really focus in on early literacy. We have some math initiatives going on as well that will continue to uh, foster and really assist our local uh, education personnel and leaders with. And um, I think the way we actually address both the flattened uh, scores, if you will, before the pandemic and then the drop um, as a result of moving through the pandemic, we use the same kinds of tools, the same kinds of frameworks in terms of best practices for really getting students back up to speed. Uh, how do we actually do a, a, a better job of using data. How do we use those to actually really fine tune and, and really dig into what the actual skills are that are not being mastered and then show up in a, in a more broader uh, assessment? Interim Secretary Heather Boucher, thank you so much for the time. Thank you very much.